One thing that stuck out today in uh, the ceremony was the emphasis on Allie and Calvin's friendship. And um, I don't think it can be understated how true this friendship is. Love is one thing, but it's nothing without friendship. How are you, sweetheart? I'm doing so good. How are you? I'm doing great. Good. <laughs> you look beautiful. Thank you. Where's the grass? Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah. I told you it would be. I yeah. know. I know. You look great. <laughs> Thank you. You show a little bit too much cleavage. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. How about this little Nevada softball touch? Oh, I love that. <laughs> I love that. Yeah. My something blue. Bows. <laughs> <laughs> we sure knew that. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I have something to put on your... Oh, oh nice. KHT, I guess you can put this on. Yeah, I'll put it on you. And then on the back it has it, today's date. It does. So you can't forget our anniversary. Oh no, I wouldn't forget. <laughs> yeah, kidding? Just kidding. Nice. I, I think that looks so nice. You look blingy. Don't you? Yeah, look. Hey, wow. You're iced out. Yeah, <laughs> whatever that means. I am. <laughs> Hi. How are you? So nervous. You, like you look so dress? pretty. Oh my god. That is awesome. I love you. Nervous. <laughs> nervous. I don't think we can kiss. Can we kiss? <laughs> oh. I like this dress a lot. I'm you waiting look for this. So handsome. This looks I'm, so nice. Oh, I'm glad. I'm nervous. The boobs are great. <laughs> I'm like that. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> See, uh, Calvin's handsome kid. I want him to cry. You will. You think so? Yeah. <laughs> Slow down. I'm excited. Hi. Half of the Tedford and Connors families, I want to thank you very much for being here today. We appreciate it very much. I, Calvin, pledge to you, Allie. I, Allie, pledge to you, Calvin. Before God, our family and friends. To be your loving friend and partner in marriage. To talk and to definitely listen. <laughs> yeah, you added something. To trust and appreciate you. To respect and cherish. Your uniqueness. <laughs> and to support, comfort. And strengthen you. Through life's joys and sorrows. May we build a home that is compassionate to all, full of respect and honor, for others and each other, and may our lives be forever filled with happiness and love. The powers vested in me by the laws of the state of Nevada and the prerogatives given to mayors of cities by the state of Idaho, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Calvin, you may now kiss my daughter. <laughs> Also your bride. <laughs> it's going in for it. 
Go ahead. I would like to introduce Mr. and Mrs. Calvin and Allie Connors. who make every person feel as important and valuable as you two do. Literally, probably everyone here thinks that they're your absolute best friend and most important person in your life. Calvin's a fine young boy, and I saw it right away. And we're very fortunate to have him in the family, as well as the Connors family. So I really want to toast to their life together and how great I know it's going to be and that they found each other and with God at the center of their life, how wonderful it will be as they go through certainly ups and downs, but mostly well balanced. And uh, shoot, they got the popcorn off the roof of their uh, ceilings of their new house. Yeah. Now I would have hired that done, but they did it themselves. So they got through that. Are you kidding? Uh, so let's toast to that, their wonderful life ahead together. And I knew Calvin from sports in high school and I'd spent a lot of time with him and he was a friend of mine. And so I knew he was just a great dude and that he'd be a really good guy to maybe be around my sister. And then he started talking to her and they started dating and things progressed and his tone when he spoke about her switched from, yeah, like I'm really lucky, to you have no idea how lucky I am. And that was when I knew this was the guy who was supposed to be my new brother. At the rehearsal dinner last night, just standing around, you could hear the joy and the love in everybody just talking, spending time, uh, really just enjoying their company. And w with that, uh, just seeing that love that they give to us, I, I want us to give that back to them tonight. For all the joy that they've given to every single person here, just, we love you guys. We love you guys immensely. I'm so 
it's crazy. A lot of people don't know this, but Ali was actually one of the first people to get COVID. Um, she lost her taste about three years ago when she started dating my brother. <laughs> So I remember when Calvin told me he was gonna uh, text Ali for the first time. Uh, I honestly laughed and I said, okay, I'm gonna text Zac Efron and he's gonna text me back faster than she'll text you back. But little did I know we'd be at their wedding and I'd still be waiting for a text back. <laughs> um, Ali, I can't think of anyone that I'd rather have join our family than you and who would be a better wife to my brother. Oh gosh. <laughs> um, you care for him, you love him unconditionally, and you always support him, and handing you off to him is one of the greatest things ever. Oh, geez. Whew. All right. Your friends see you as a tough guy. Um, Mom and Dad, they see you as the favorite child. Uh, Ali sees you as your everything, but I see you as a role model in my life. Um, you've always, oh goodness. <laughs> um, you've always been there to push me and push me on the ground sometimes. <laughs> but we've been through so much together growing up and there's no, geez, I didn't think I'd cry this much. Um, you were always my shoulder to cry on when things got tough. And you've always been one of my biggest supporters. Thank you for everything you've done for me and for always being there for me, I love you. Calvin and Ali, it's an honor to get to be here and celebrate you today. I know that I kind of like have to be here because I'm your sister, but I still feel really blessed and honored to have been included in your celebration as I'm sure that we all feel that way. I want to start with saying that just look at this couple. We can all see how beautiful they are on the outside. Um, you, you can take, take a good look. <laughs> Um, but I, what I really wanted to talk about tonight is how beautiful they are. <laughs> um, Ali is my baby sister. I've looked up to you your whole life. Um, to share a birthday with you and a whole lot of years and memories with you is the greatest gift. Um, like I mentioned before, and I think that we all know that and that's why we're here today. You guys are even more beautiful on the inside than you are on the outside, which is pretty hard to be. Um, everyone has mentioned it already tonight. You make everyone better around you, and the way that you do that is just by inspiring them um, to be the best that they can be because of how you love other people, how you bring them in. You two make the most perfect pair. And today when you guys were saying your vows, which I was trying to remember exactly what dad said and what you guys were saying, and I can't remember, but it was something. And I just thought <laughs> marriage is a really big deal. And what you guys have done today is a huge, huge deal that we're all so excited to get to witness. And we could not be more excited to be in this beautiful place with all of you. So let's go have fun. Woo!